Dylan, uh, uh, I guess best performance of your tenure, day longest performance of your tenure. What was working? How good did you feel? And, and did you go out there thinking like, okay, after one that could have gone either way last night, really got to gotta be on today? Uh, yeah, I mean, not really. Uh, our guys were ready to go today. Last night didn't affect us. It's, it's a new day today. Um, and for me, just landing my sinker, trusting it, throwing it for strikes, uh, that's where everything starts. So, I mean, if I got that thing going, it's going to be – usually a good day so from early on I mean first bat of the game started 3-0 so that wasn't ideal uh, but after that started landing it and, and trusting it. Dylan got two for you the defense seemed a lot sharper behind you today turned a few double plays Ethan made a nice a few nice stops at uh, first just how uh, how good does it feel to have the defense backing you up in such a big way this weekend? Yeah that was awesome uh, I mean last week I was walking people and Errors tend to come when you when you bore, bore your defense. So I mean, threw more strikes today, kept innings quick, kept the defense engaged. Uh, so I think those go hand in hand. Yeah. And then did you try pleading with Matt coming off the mound uh, before you came out? And then you know Eli Jones first guy to greet you. What he say to you? And just you know how how good is it to hear the fans uh, give you that type of reception after a start like that? Yeah. I I mean I argued a little bit. I didn't really have a chance there. Uh, I was done. Uh, but I mean Eli's always the first one out there every pitcher who who's coming out of the game good or bad and he's always he's always proud of you and he's got something for you he gives you a big hug uh he's our leader he's our he's our guy uh and the pitching staff um and then what was the last part of that question oh yeah i mean i heard that walking off and it was a great feeling um you gotta love that right there uh, kennedy four rbis today eight for the series i think what's working so well for you right now and do you kind of like hitting in this new sort of lineup combination Mark's put together this weekend? Uh, as long as I can hit with running score position, I think I can help my team. So I came up big a few times. Um, I don't think I really try anything new. I'm just trying to trust the process and just stay confident. I think it's the biggest thing as a hitter. When you stay confident, you'll come up in those situations. So. Hey, Kennedy, 23 runs for, for you guys over the last two games. Um, what is it about the, the lineup and the restructuring that, that has made things click from, from an offensive standpoint? Um, I just think we're really picking each other up. You know, we're, we're playing as a team. We're, we're playing as one. Um, you have one bad at bat, your brother's going to come and pick you up the next at bat. So we're really picking each other up. and staying, we're, We've always had the same approach. We're just sticking to it, and we're just, we're just going along with the process. Kennedy, kind of sticking with that theme, Coach has talked with us plenty of times about confidence and you guys being able to kind of get over the hump and get a series win like this and kind of sustain it. What does it feel like to be able to pull off this and hopefully sustain it moving forward? Oh, it feels really good. Uh, we've lost a few close games this season, and we've always wanted to pull it off, and we finally did it. So it feels good knowing that we can, we know we can win those, those close games and these big games. So it feels really good as a team. Be from both of you, you know, from the pitching, to the hitting, to the hitting with runners in scoring position, to moving runners up, to the double plays. Would you, would you say this was the best game of the season that the team has put in in practically every aspect of playing the game? Yeah, I, I'd say everything was put together today, hitting, defense, pitching, um, all of it. That's the most complete game I think we've played thus far this year and probably in the SEC. Yeah, I think it goes hand in hand. When you have Eskew up there working his butt off on the mound, I mean, we just want to get runs for him. You know, when the defense turns double plays, when we get that momentum, we just we're just ready to score runs for him. Yeah. I, I know Mr. Bradley um, spoke to you guys on on Friday night, uh, the first African American student athlete at, at South Carolina. What what did y'all take from from what he had to say? Uh, he actually had some awesome things to say. Um, just to keep calm and trust your process, trust your work. Um, and it was really cool to have him in here and the historic person that he is coming in here and sharing his words with us. And he actually threw a, a dart today for a strike on the mound. So that was pretty cool too. He still got it. Yeah, biggest thing is he said that I took from just trust the process. When, when stuff's not going wood, going good, don't try to turn away from it. Start trying new stuff. Just get your work in and it'll come and stay confident.